the average ambient temperature for the UK is around 5 degrees Celsius or lower for a third of the year. Most industrial process cooling applications have a water leaving temperature of 10 degrees Celsius or above. This means that the ambient air temperature can be used to provide chilled water for a significant proportion of the year. So you could be saving up to 80% on energy costs and reducing your environmental impact. Here's how. Free cooling. Free cooling works with either a chiller with a built-in free cooling coil or a free cooler working in series with a chiller. The latter is more efficient due to the larger surface area provided by the free cooler. When the ambient air temperature drops below the process fluid return temperature, a three-way valve diverts the returning process fluid through the free cooling coil in which the cooler ambient air removes process heat and cools the returning fluid. At just one degree Celsius below the process return fluid temperature, the fluid is partially cooled by the free cooler. It then flows through the chiller's evaporator where the required set point temperatures are achieved, easing the demand on your chiller's components and extending their operational life. As the ambient air temperature continues to fall, the amount of process heat taken out of the process fluid by the air increases, progressively reducing the load on the chiller. When the ambient air temperature is 5 degrees Celsius below the process supply fluid temperature, all the process heat is removed by the ambient air in the free cooler, providing full free cooling. The process fluid is therefore being cooled by the fans, rather than a compressor which is traditionally the most energy intensive element of a chiller, thus reducing your energy and maintenance costs and improving the lifespan of your components even further. There are many benefits to utilizing free cooling. A free cooler with a 300 kilowatt chiller at 15 degrees Celsius outlet temperature could create savings in the region of 35,000 pounds a year. Reduction in mechanical energy consumption up to 80%. Reduced load on mechanical parts, therefore reduced maintenance cost and extended life of equipment. Smaller load demands can lessen the depreciation value of the chiller over its lifetime. It is easy to retrofit, space permitting. Payback in as little as three months. Unlike cooling towers, there is no risk of Legionella. Thanks to the energy efficiency of free cooling, you may be eligible for up to £5,000 of funding for energy efficient equipment replacement through the Carbon Trust. Download our guide to free cooling or visit www.icscoolenergy.com for more information.